Okay, so I've got an idea of a song. Yeah. We'll play three seconds of it. Okay. And then everyone watching has to guess. Are you going to like clip to that bit? The song name. Yeah, because it's. Yeah, I'll, I'll cut that. Oh, the... okay, so I don't like have to get it off my phone or anything. No, you don't have to do that right now. We'll cut it. But they have to get the song. So we're making this an interactive video. It's. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the problem is, as soon yeah. as one person comments, they give the answer away, so I don't know how we're going to do that. Died. That was pretty scary. Yeah, unfortunately we weren't recording it. Probably best we weren't, to be fair. A lot of swearing involved there. Yeah. And we haven't even left Lovettsville, really. No. We're about, <laughs> I think we're about four miles down the road and we had to perform an emergency stop. And then there was a big truck behind us that went off the road. We had to, the truck in front went off the, onto the shoulder. It's only a single truck, well not single, a double truck road, but the truck in front went to the right, I went to the left and just pulled up beside him and then another car came, almost went into the back of us and then a huge truck just came down the right hand side. So yeah, that would have been fun. Yeah, that would have been a great Could start. Could have ruined, <laughs> ruined everything. Yeah. <laughs> um, we, oh, uh, we're leaving. We're leaving. Yeah. We're doing it. We've left. We're almost to Leesburg now. We've massively overpacked. Massively. Um, I can't even. There's stuff that I'm like, why am I bringing this? I haven't used the cheese grater in about two years. I'm so lazy. I buy grated cheese. But I bought the cheese grater just in case we're stuck one day. And we're like, you know what? We need to grate some cheese. <laughs> I think. I know we're four miles down the road, but my biggest regret already is all of my tools. It's like my comfort blanket. Just bought every single one. So I think I've like, yeah, I probably, in fact I blame you. Why? Because I could, oh, um, Beep. Shoot. Um, <laughs> uh, I was going to buy a new toolkit just for this. And you said no, just bring your tools. So I just threw everything in a box, and I think. Okay, I still think you own... should have made a camper toolkit. You've had plenty of time. I've been busy. <laughs> We've had a year to plan this. I'm sure one of those days you could have made. I didn't a... think this was going to happen. <laughs> this was your idea. <laughs> I have a lot of ideas, and most of them don't happen. Oh my goodness. But it is happening. So is. I panicked and just threw everything in a big box and it weighs like 300 pounds. Okay, we're here, we arrived. Uh, we're at our first place. Um, we're just here for one night um, and then we're going to head on down south. Um, we're pretty tired. We loaded up the trailer this morning. We left at what? 1.30? One, 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 yeah. Between 1 or 2 or something. We got here and it's just past 6 something. Yeah. 6 o'clock or something like that. Um, we haven't even disconnected from the truck because the site's so level. So we just, we just rolled up. We put the stabilizers down. We hooked up the electric. Um, and yeah, it's uh, it, it's nice. We're pretty settled. We've put the heat on because it is freezing. Yeah, what it's was about it? four degrees, which is about thirty-eight Fahrenheit. Yeah, so it was cold. So we've got the we've got the fireplace on. Let me show you. <laughs> oh, hopefully you can see that. So we have the fireplace on. We're cooking some dinner now. We've got the TV all hooked up. Our internet is amazing. I'm getting like 80, 80 meg. Um, so that's quick, quicker than we had at home. Um, yeah, so that's it. So we're going to get sorted. Roxy's cold. Um, <laughs> so we're going to eat. Might come back on later. Don't know. We're pretty tired, so we'll see how it goes. But um, if not, then hopefully we can show you us leaving tomorrow. Couldn't really show you the campground because it's dark, so you wouldn't see anything anyway. Yeah. 
So here we are, day one. It's freezing. Uh, we uh, froze overnight. We got here about seven, something like that, six or seven. Had some dinner set up, everything was fine. Um, and it's empty. There is like, there's one other pe person here right now. There were other people overnight, but what I figured out, Natalie. Yeah. Come here. Okay. So what we found out, or what I think is happening here, is that there are two types of people that were here last night. When we arrived, there were like some sprinter vans, um, you know, like the converted Mercedes sprinter things into campers. They all left really early, and the only two people left are us in our grand design reflection and an airstream. And I think because it's like nine o'clock now, everyone else left at like five, and I think it's just us yuppies, like <laughs> non-travelers who are a little bit hungover every morning and can't really get up at five to go and do stuff like that. No. Ooh, your alarm. Wake up. See, that's my alarm telling me. I don't it's know like 10 o'clock. <laughs> so, yeah. So yeah, that's what I think. Hmm. Adaptive cruise control sensor has stopped working. It's a good start, isn't it? For day two. Sorry, I'm kind of throwing you around. So we're getting a lot of faults, a lot of flashing and beeping, and we're only five minutes into our journey to Georgia. Yay! Okay, so the competition is yeah. we're going to play a little clip of a song, yeah. three seconds, so we don't get banned by YouTube by co for copyright. Yeah. They have to say. So I've got a song in mind, right? If it works, then they have to tell us what the song name is, who sang it, who wrote it, and. You know, they can just Google that information from the song name. That'd be yeah. completely okay. pointless. Okay. How long it took the person to write it? That will still be on Google also. Well, maybe. That's a bit more effort, isn't it? And what movie it's from. That will be harder. So people might know the song, but not might not know the movie. Okay. Okay, fine. Let's do it. Okay, so we got it lined up. Right. So, you ready? Yeah. Play it for like two or three seconds. Okay. And then, and then cut it. Okay. Go. Okay. Yes. Okay. Hopefully we won't get banned on YouTube for this, but so. Oh this no, is, our this, 30 this followers will be so disappointed. See, look, I'm not even paying attention now. Okay. Right, so you have to tell us what the song is called, who wrote it, who sang it, how long it took them to write it, and what movie it's from. Okay, good luck. Do we give clues? No, uh, no clues. Okay. Oakley, Oakley can't answer this. Uh, or John. Or John, Oakley and John can't ask. <laughs> For anyone else, that's fine. Good luck everyone else. Okay, this is fun. <laughs> been a long drive today almost six hours and um, we just got here it's like uh, 5 p.m. it's just getting dark um, getting eager to go set, get set up for the week get everything sorted and we can finally sort the trailer out and uh, I've been sat here for about 20 minutes whilst I can see Natalie laughing away laughing away checking in Let's see if that'll focus See her there, laughing away. Oh, here she comes. Into the black hole. For my soul. The black hole. Okay, 
So I just want to give you a quick tour of the trailer. Uh, a lot of people have asked questions about it. So, uh, so here goes. This is a 15 berth trailer. Don't believe me? Wait. So as you walk in, you walk in the door here that I just came through and then immediately this is the living area. So, uh, so the cool thing about this, one reason why we chose this is because we have a slide here and a slide back here. Uh, it makes it much wider. If you can imagine this kitchen behind here was much further over, it's really claustrophobic. Uh, it's very narrow. So the way these both open opposite each other is, is awesome, loads of space. Um, we have, uh, we have the uh, coffee counter here, which is cool. Um, that's nice, we've got tons of storage. We have the fridge, we have the convection microwave, uh, we have the oven and uh, hob, uh, then we have the TV. Over there we have a fireplace, which is just an electric fireplace. Then this is cool, this is the, uh, the centre um, island, centre island, kitchen island. I don't know, I don't know my kitchens. Um, very nice, it has a very nice sink in here. A uh, double sink with these covers that can uh, double up as chopping boards. Uh, then we have our uh, dining area here. Never use it, we just put stuff there. Um, and then we have our fancy fancy chairs. They're uh, massaging chairs, they're heated, um, and they have some nice cool blue LED lights, which is nice at night. Um, tons of storage. This is probably the most important area. Um, so this is the, uh, the wet bar not because it's wet, it's because this is where the alcohol is. This is key. key. Okay, we'll go through. So this is the man room. So this is my office. Um, uh, this is a bunk up here. So if we ever had anyone stay, unlikely, but if we ever had anyone stay, then uh, they could stay up here. Tons of storage here. Now if we swing around, sorry if I make you dizzy, uh, there was another bunk up here with a sofa underneath. I took that out and I built this desk. Um, so uh, that's all hooked up and uh, the monitors on the wall didn't fall off when we were driving. That was cool. Um, and so yeah, so this is where I spend most of my time working. Okay, let's go back through. Okay, as you walk in from the main door, right opposite that is the uh, is the bathroom. It's like this is a sink, this is a shower, and this is a toilet. It's where we do stuff. Okay, and this is our bedroom. This is where the magic happens. And by magic, I mean how Natalie makes a bed, because I have no idea how you get over here to get the sheet on it. Actually, I do, she couldn't do it and I had to help, which, which is fine. I'm, it's not like a girl's job or anything, but you know, I'm working and she looks after the bed. Anyway, there is tons of storage in here. So there's tons of storage in here, these are, uh, go all the way back or forward wherever this is the front of the trailer these go all the way here uh, there's USB ports up there there's a power supply up there uh, tons of storage up in here it goes all the way back to there as well there is more storage under the bed you can lift this up and it's under there um, and then in here sorry, bit of a mess uh, we have a uh, washer dryer outputs there which are cool so if we ever didn't want to use the laundry facilities at a campground or go to a laundromat, we, we can just use that. Uh, we also installed a second TV up here, which is nice. Um, uh, it, it wasn't very expensive. There is a mounting just stuff behind the wall so that you can mount it. I had to buy the mount, $8 from Amazon or something. Um, and so yeah, so that's nice to have that. We have a fire stick in there and we watch TV in bed. Um, yeah, so uh, so that's the that's the trailer. Um, there's some fa some other stuff going on in here as well, and I'll try and give you a tour of the outside at some point. Um, but I just wanted to give you a quick tour inside because I've had a bunch of questions about it. Love it. Yeah. 
I have been looking at your latest video and you happen to mention that this was a 15 birth trailer. Yeah. How on earth is it a 15 birth trailer? I'll show you. So. One. Yep. Two. Yes. Maybe three, not us obviously. <laughs> uh, then the dinette folds down. Okay. So four, five. Okay. And then in here, we have two on here. Mm, okay. So let's say that was four. Right. Five, six. Yeah. There was another bunk here, so that would be seven, eight. Okay. I took it out. Um, and then, uh, when I have a drink, sometimes I fall asleep here. Okay. Is that nine? Yeah. Not very good at counting. Sometimes I will fall asleep in this chair. Okay. Ten. Okay. Then in the morning, when I get up, I sometimes fall asleep in the shower. Okay. So I've Okay. I don't know what that is. What's that? Eleven. Yes. And then, if um, oh, when I'm working, actually not when I'm working, when I'm up late editing videos. Here. Okay. Sometimes, when this gets a bit uncomfortable, I can just lie down here. Okay. How many is that? Like thirteen. Thirteen. Okay. And then when um, I'm too tired to go to bed after I've been asleep on here and had a few drinks, space here. This is not a bed, but okay. And then if we have a seat out here, I could be out in the sun and I'll fall asleep out here. That's not even in the trailer, that doesn't count. Fine, 14. <laughs> We'll agree on 14. So that's it for this week. Uh, we hope you enjoyed watching us drive down to Savannah, Georgia. Uh, we're gonna go explore, see what we can find this week, and we will see you next week. Bye. Eastbound down, load up and trucking. We gon' do what they say can be done.